Okay, so VA Urgent Care Services. What do you need to know? Veterans enrolled in VA healthcare can use over 4,000 urgent care locations across the country, including VA medical centers and in-network community providers to treat non-life-threatening conditions. This can include minor illnesses and injuries like strep throat, ouch, sprained muscles, yeah, I'll deal with that, and skin infections, so don't come near me. They can provide diagnostic services like x-rays and some type of lab tests. Of course, the superhero side effects aren't guaranteed. That's still in testing. And you can also get some types of medicines and vaccines. You can often get care for these non-life-threatening conditions much faster than in an emergency room. For more information, visit va.gov and search urgent care. So what's going on this weekend? You got some chores around the house? Going for a drive to the in-laws? Long layover in Charlotte? You know what goes great with those? A podcast. New Horizons in Health. This podcast is about the cutting edge research and treatments happening at VA that are advancing care for veterans. Hello and welcome to New Horizons in Health, bringing veteran healthcare into the future. What do you think the role is of healthcare providers themselves, including medical students, by the way, health professional trainees? Uh, in identifying and addressing loneliness and social isolation with patients. Yeah, look, I think that the healthcare system and our nurses, our doctors, our trainees, they can play a really powerful role here. Just even asking about loneliness and isolation can be a powerful first step. Find New Horizons in Health wherever you normally get your podcasts. Just search New Horizons in Health. VA diagnoses about 4,000 new cases of colorectal cancer each year. It's one of the most common cancers in the United States. So let's talk about the facts. Who should get screened and why screening is more accessible to veterans than you might think. The risk of colorectal cancer increases with age and screening is recommended for all adults aged 45 to 75. The key to screening is early detection, which is why screening is recommended even when symptoms aren't present. Now, a colonoscopy is still critical for veterans who need the procedure. But get this, you can be screened for colorectal cancer from the comfort of your home with an easy to use test kit called a Fit Kit. I'm not getting into that acronym. Fit Kits, you get it? It is not only more convenient for you, but also helps increase VA's screening capacity by offering the test to veterans without requiring them to visit their provider. To learn more about colorectal cancer screening at VA, visit cancer.va.gov and talk to your VA provider about requesting a fit screening. All right, that's your bottom line up front. I'll see you next time here on The Bluff.